Hi, I'm Claire Stone and here's another video of my Facebook group Claire's Crystal Cavern. So today I'm going to be talking to you about how to use sage to smudge the aura. So first of all I'm just going to show you what a bundle of um, sage looks like. So this is dried sage and this one's got cedar in it as well and um, what you do with this you basically light it and the smoke just cleanses and purifies any negative energies and entities that may be lurking around in your aura. You can also use it in your house as well. Um, it's particularly good if you do any therapies to have um, a, a waft before and after clients come along. I always use this to clean my tarot cards before I do readings as well. So basically, um, it was the Native American Indians, the um, plant medicine people that come up with the sage and realized how holy it was and how cleansing. And um, the, the way that you do it, you have, you have this special shell, it's called an abalone shell, and you get your bundle of sage and you literally light it. It takes a minute to get going because it, it's so dry. And then once you've got it going, you use um, a special feather. I've got a peacock feather because this is really um, special medicine for me, peacocks. And you just waft it all around your aura. Lexi, would you like your aura wafted? Come here then, Baba. So if you just stand here, because you're on the camera, and you start off, and you start just above the crown. Is that nice? Yeah. And then under your armpits, lift your arms out. Ooh. And then turn around. And you might have to relight it, because, um, like I said, it's really dry and it goes out. Let's do your back. Turn around. Oh, there you are. Your aura is lovely and sparkly, isn't it? And don't forget to do under your feet. So sit down, get your feet up. Oh, wonderful. Come on, lift them feet up. Because negative energy um, hangs around, wall down because it's denser, it's it's heavier. So the lighter vibrations are up the top, but the heavy dark vibrations uh, down low the ground and by your feet as well. So you use your sage um, to purify your space anytime you want. Um, it could be that you're doing something special like a ceremony or a reading or a therapy, or you could just be that you just fancy um, a clean. Maybe you've had some stress, a stressful day and some stressful thoughts and you just want to cleanse that. So that's your sage. Um, and I've got sage it's with cedar like a and it is like a fan yay and this is um, another thing that you can use it's called palo I santo it's a holy that. wood um, that's really sweet so that's another thing that you can use for cleansing your aura and just you can cleanse cards and crystals with these um, with these products as well this one's really sweet do you like the smell of that one Lexi? Hot. It is hot, isn't it? Do you prefer the sage or the Palo Santo? Which do you like best? Sage, yeah, me too. Um, another um, product that I've got, it's Archangel Michael Vibrational Essence. And um, if you've read any of the books by uh, the late Masuru Emoto, he talks about how um, the water crystals, how memory is stored into water. So he did um, lots and lots of examples of it. You can find it all over the internet. And um, he, he basically, if you if you told some water that he looked at it, it was beautiful. When you looked, it's goes yummy. In. It is yummy. It's Archangel Michael. He's our favourite, isn't he? Yeah. Um, the water crystals. You looked under the microscope and. The, the, it had formed these amazing crystal shapes, but then the water was told that it was um, ugly and disgusting, and that didn't form anything at all. It was just kind of um, no, no nice lovely patterns to it. So it proved that, that by blessing your water, it really. Do, I mean, we're made of water, so it's important um, that, to realise that everything is vibration, everything is energy. The Water in this is from Avalon, um, half from the male spring and half from the female spring. And it was left on the Archangel Michael ley line overnight. Uh, it's also got crystals in it and essential oils. So this is another um, thing that I just spray in my aura. It's Archangel Michael. 
I actually make this. Um, if you want to have a look at any more vibrational essences, you can have a look at my website, holisticheaven.org, or on my Facebook book, Facebook page, um, Close Crystal Cabin. Thanks for listening. You need what, Baba? You need some Archangel Michael? I need this.